Welcome back, everyone. It's Stray Fay here with. It's possibly the last episode of Harvest Moon Tree of Tranquility. Okay, I skipped ahead to day 28 of winter, day before the new year. <laughs> this is the last day we get to see our baby like this. Because tomorrow, tomorrow is our baby's first birthday. So yeah, all we have left to do is a few scattered um, child events here and there, and then, and then trying to get like the final final ending of the game, which will ultimately destroy the, destroy the save file. So I mean, it won't destroy it, but it's probably a good idea if you split your save file once you do do the final ending. Anywho, the year is almost over. See if we celebrate- do we just celebrate it with our wife or is our like toddler in the picture as well? This is- okay, the, the toddler's sleeping I guess. I hate mulling over the past and regretting stuff. I guess re reflection is necessary. How was your year? Looking back at the entire year? <laughs> a lousy year. <laughs> I mean last time I said it was a <laughs> Come on, it's been a lousy year. I just, I just been sleeping, <laughs> sleeping the entire year. Oh, I'm sorry to hear that. Well, next year will be better. <laughs> I wonder if that decreased her affection. What's this? Listen, I can hear the New Year's bell. The New Year is here. Pretty sure this is gonna be the same. As last episodes, is Perry Perry just gonna be greeting everyone instead of Chloe? Yep, <laughs> it's so funny how like Perry just takes over Chloe's job of like being being town greeter. Hello. Talking to all the old people and jumping up and down. Yay! Oh no! That's not true. I don't do that, but... Are you just like talking in the middle of a conversation? Hmm. <laughs> I'm a bit sleepy, but let's go to see the first sunrise of the new year. We can't miss it. Miss the first sunrise of the year. It's still cold, but there's a touch of spring in the air. Let's make our New Year's resolutions. <laughs> what is your New Year's resolution? <laughs> well, I guess early to bed, early to rise. <laughs> That's what I've been doing for the entire year. Yeah, let's resolve to have a good year. Now let's go home. Sorry, like the first day of the year. I'm already not doing it. <laughs> We're staying up. We're staying up all night. All right, let's see my progress for this year, which is none. Down, 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 down. <laughs> Zero. All right, spring. Let's go. This is what I've really been waiting for. Now the new stuff is gonna happen. Oh, look at her! Wow, her outfit's actually really cute! Pff. Hey, Artemis! Yes? T Get your father, please. Okay, I'll go now. Dad, morning! Mom says that breakfast is ready. <laughs> I don't know what voice to give her. <laughs> and she is an adult, not really an adult, but a child, like, that I can talk- She's really cute! I actually like- I like her outfit. 
I think if I had a boy, he would also have like a purple themed outfit, like a purple tunic. Hi. Oh, what's happening here? Oh, okay, this is actually... <laughs> right away. Um, this is actually part of the final ending, so... Papa, do you believe in fairies? Do fairies exist? Maybe, maybe not. <laughs> um, maybe? Because I saw some. They were wearing pointed hats. They're red, yellow, green, and purple. I already told those guys not to come here. <laughs> I'm not sure though. I know that's just a fairy tale and I don't believe it, but I just thought I'd ask you to believe them in them, Papa. Do you believe in them? It was probably tr <laughs> Of course. Of course I believe in them. You're silly, Papa. But I'm glad you don't think I'm crazy. Don't worry, I'm crazy too. I see the silly little men as well. <laughs> I didn't say that I wanted to see them again, but if you just see them again, then I'll let you know. Okay. I guess we'll have to like wait another day. <laughs> this is like a series of events until... Until, uh... You finally get prompted to do the thing. Alright, now I actually get to talk to her. <laughs> Good morning! I think this year will be pretty much the same as last year. What do you want to do with Artemis? Oh. <laughs> right! She can do chores! I forgot! Like we- Cause like my wife doesn't do any chores. We can go for a walk as well. Um, let's see, the chores she can do is pretty much nothing because I don't have any crops to water. I can't pick any crops. Go for a walk. It's sort of like walking the dog. Okay, I'll come with you. I don't really care, though. Oh, well, yeah. It's, it's, it's kind of like walking the dog. <laughs> like, you walk around for a bit, you gain, like, a little bit of affection. And then, like, you go home. Alright, what do I want to wear? I want to wear something else. Not that. <laughs> Not that. Wear my green outfit. Do, 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 do. So yeah, um... Oh, what was my train of thought before I got distracted by talking? So... Yeah, this... This model of child... Um, you get this child if you marry... Chase, Calvin, Luna, or Selena. So like, there's a lot of potential... Bachelor and Bachelorette that can have this child. Um, there's also four other child types. That's that's race. There's also a couple other child types. Um, if you married Phoebe or Owen, you'd get kind of like a standard-looking child. They describe it as mischievous, but it looks it looks pretty obedient to me. Um, Toby, Julius, Renee, or Maya would have a romantic-looking child. Kind of has like a dreamy look in their eyes. And Luke or Kathy would have a fiery looking child. Kind of like, kind of angry eyes. <laughs> as the best way I can describe it. With like, kind of spiky hair. Like even the girl kind of has like spikes on the end of her hair. And then uh, the last one. Jill, or G Gil, Jin, Anissa, or Candace will have kind of a smart looking child with glasses. Yeah, we got the brash one. <laughs> we got the brash child that looks like who's always judging us. I really like her purple outfit. It's really cute. So, yeah. I'm gonna go back home. <laughs> I'm, gonna, I'm gonna go back home. Um, I think she... Do you follow me outside, like, the whole day? I hope not. But that was a good walk! Artemis and I really bonded during that walk together. <laughs> We sure did. Are you still in here? I also want to give you a present because technically today's your birthday. A birthday present? I really like this. Thanks. I'm I'm happy. What do you? Nothing. <laughs> I'm done. I'm done with the kid. <laughs> I don't want her to do anything. She can she can enjoy her day. Oh well, yeah. How many hearts do I have with my kid right now? 
Um, her heart seemed to go up pretty quickly. Just, just from talking to her, I like already got her like to five hearts. So I think they, they allow your kid to gain affection a little bit faster. <laughs> I also did like continue befriending the other kids off screen for like no apparent reason. You only need two hearts with them to get an event with with them and your child. Van and I are really good friends. We're best we're best buds. So yeah. Uh what else? What else is unique about the child? I did kinda like talk about talk about it last time. But like each like kid personality has has a different likes and dislikes. So, as you can see, I gave my child herb tea. That's like the easiest thing I can give that child. Otherwise, kind of like s spicy food, like stir fry, spicy stew, like kimchi, coconut juice, grape juice, pineapple juice, southern omelet, and southern fried rice and ratatouille. This seems like a lot of things that would be like Selena's favorite thing. Not a lot you would think would like transfer over to Luna. I think I think this child was just like kind of modeled after Selena and they just kind of gave they, they shared it with Luna. Cause otherwise you'd think she'd like like sweets and stuff. Um, there is a kid that likes sweet stuff. The romantic child likes a lot of sweet stuff pretty much. <laughs> pretty much all sweets like chocolate bars, chocolate fondue, hot cocoa, strawberry milk, apple pie, chocolate pie. Shortcake, like every single cake, all juices. Wow, that romantic child likes a lot of sweets. You think that would be <laughs> the the progeny of L Luna, but no, but I guess not. Let's see, a cool child. Um, the one with glasses, the smart-looking child, likes a lot of rice dishes. It seems like, like cheese risotto, tomato risotto, chestnut rice, potato rice. There's a lot of. A lot of rice dishes that kid likes. Also likes herb tea and milk tea. So, if I did have a smart, a smart child, I would just go with the herb tea, cause that's the easiest option. Let's see, mischievous child, which is what Owen's, Phoebe and Owen's child likes. What a lot of egg dishes. That makes sense, cause I know Owen, Owen likes his eggs. Like his eggs a lot. Oh, you finally left the house! There she goes! Are you just gonna hang out on the farm today? <laughs> and what's the last child that we haven't talked about? Fiery child? Luke's 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 child? Also likes a lot of egg dishes. A lot of fish dishes as well. That that's kind of a <laughs> this is like a hard child to cater to. Although that child does like eggs, so. Just getting getting a chicken and then you're good. Are you, are you going to the waterfall? Where are you? Where are you? Oh, you're going to the river. Are you gonna go fishing? Do you fish? Do you just stare out in the water blankly? Oh, you're getting your feet wet. <laughs> so yeah, that's pretty much all I could say about the kids, really. I'm I'm happy. I'm happy that they <laughs> that they let the kid grow up this far, cause. And Magical Melody and Friends of Mineral Town. Our kid only was like pretty much forever stunted at the toddler phase and like it didn't grow up anymore. I mean it's not as cool as a wonderful life where your kid like reaches adulthood, but still. I like I like this, because like you get like you got a choice of five unique looking children. I guess technically ten unique looking children because like boy and girl variants and they actually kind of speak English and <laughs> you kind of converse with them. You can have them do chores. Well duh. Flowers bloom in spring. What's so special about that? Everyone just stop making a big deal about it. <laughs> you do chores and go on walks with them. There's like more interaction than just like hey talk to them and then bye go to sleep all right well should i like brb for like a minute um i do want to celebrate my child's birthday you can do that by actually i could like probably run around and talk to me eh. Eh. <laughs> people probably do have stuff to say about like my kid being older but am i gonna find anyone in time 
But yeah, if you go inside your house at 6 p.m. or a little bit after 6 p.m., you can celebrate your child's birthday just like we celebrated our birthday. It'll be like a whole, whole cake thing. Hey, is anyone home? Probably not. They're probably all out and about exploring. I can only really find people in here in the morning. Okay, I, I guess I'll just go home. <laughs> well, yeah, bonus dialogue if you want. Talk to people and they'll talk about your all grown up kid. Zara, she's already one years old. They grow up so fast. <laughs> it's so weird to think like a one year old is like a fully functioning person. And I guess what's even more amazing that the rival kids are just like. After one month, they were a functioning person. What's happening? I just had a very strange feeling. <laughs> wow, it forces you! It forces you to celebrate your kid's birthday! L let's go back to the house! With my birthday, it was optional! Wow. I mean, you could have skipped this by sleeping, but still. Welcome home! I made a feast for you. Wait, for me? Not for me. Or... It's definitely not for me. What occasion is this? I don't know. Huh? Don't tell me that you don't remember what today is! Do you know what today is? Partner's birthday, child's birthday, wedding anniversary. No, wait, wedding, wedding anniversary is in summer. <laughs> it's my child's birthday. Of course I do that. <laughs> Excellent, darling. You're wonderful. What should we do for a present? Uh, wait. What should it be? Oh. <laughs> it's like a list. Clearly not junk ore. Well, we kind of already know that she likes herb tea. I don't think any of the kids like... I think they mostly just like food. I don't know about like non-edibles. <laughs> Stuff that they like. <laughs> so yeah, she's gonna want herb tea. Here you go, I, I somehow wrapped it. That's a crappy gift. I would want an amethyst. <laughs> Out of all that, I would want an amethyst. <laughs> it's like, don't, don't gift wrap like some tea, okay? <laughs> Wonderful, our child would be very happy. Yay, yay. And that's it, wow, wow, I thought, I thought. I thought I could get some more dialogue out of that. Nope. Just jump up and down and hooray. Uh, did that, was, that, was that like a noticeable boost? I think I think I gained like a whole heart actually. Jeez. Kid, calm down. Alright, I think I'm gonna go to bed um, and see what happens the next day. Um, yeah, there'll be a lot of sleeping involved here. Because there are some events that I could, like, easily manipulate with, like, time. And there's some events that are just, like, kind of RNG, so I'm just gonna have to, like, sleep through days and, like, Let's go. edit to when something actually happens. What's what's happening? <laughs> what's happening? Yes? Who is it? Huh? What are you doing here, Hamilton? Good morning. I was just passing by while taking a walk and thought I'd say hi. By the way, Artemis has gotten big. Time sure does fly. What are you doing here? Get out of my house, you old man. Oh no. Artemis may, be, may look all grown up, but Artemis is still just a child. Yes, Hamilton, what do you want with my daughter? She's only one year old. Well, I'd say the child is definitely mature enough to give the journey rucksack to. Um, what? There's a custom on this island. When your child is ready to move into adulthood, you give them the journey rucksack. I sent my child on a journey to grow into a responsible adult. You sent Gil off? <laughs> you sent Gil off at one years old? You're a horrible father. No wonder, like, 
Gil always has this, like, jaded look in his eyes. Of course, sending them on a journey is an old custom. I don't even think there's anyone left who makes the journey rucksacks anymore. Well, I've talked long enough. I better get going. Oh, let me get you a cup of tea now. Make yourself at home. No, I should get going. If you excuse me, I'll come visit you again sometime. Okay, that was weird. <laughs> Alright, I wonder who makes the journey rug sack. Good morning. Huh? What? Nothing. I'm not gonna make you anything today, child. Here, have some tea. You would think you'd have to go- <laughs> I'm not really happy or anything. You'd think you'd have to go to, like, the tailors for this. But no. Um... I think you have to go... I think the Harvest Rites help you help with this quest, actually. I haven't done this quest, so... By the way, I, I think I mentioned before that I've never had a kid. <laughs> when I played, I, I got pregnant, but then I stopped playing. <laughs> yeah, Hamilton sure was weird today, huh? Good morning! Keeping an eye on Artemis is so hard. I'm exhausted. Is she faster than you? <laughs> it seemed like I just have two kids in my house, honestly. <laughs> uh... <laughs> I need to, the cops need to be called on me. I have two girls in my house. Yucky I guess I'll go to sleep again, right? Yeah, I guess. Yeah, I think I'll go to sleep again. See if there's another event in the morning. Do 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 do. Let's go to sleep. There's nothing I have to fear or water. Ta-da! Let's go! Let's go! Darling, eat your lunch and work hard today! Receive shining lunchbox. Alright, child. Has anything changed? Something has changed! Within a day. Okay, we got the Harvest Goddess music here. Papa, listen. I had a weird dream. There was some pretty lady with wings in it. Oh. Um, this is kind of... This is kind of what happened to me at the beginning of our adventure. It felt so real. She was asking for help. Oh, wait. But we already helped the goddess. Who is this? Who's talking to you? I kind of felt like I should help her. Hmm. This. <laughs> oh, what? Okay. Hmm. Okay, that's weird. All right, we need some answers, I think. <laughs> Cause like we already we already helped the goddess. Like she appeared in our dreams at the beginning. N n you don't have to do anything. She she appeared in our dreams at like the beginning of the LP, but we already we already saved her. So, um, yeah, we're gonna probably have to ask the goddess what is up. What is up? Why is she appearing in our child's dream? If it even is the goddess. Maybe there's some some other lady with wings is popping up in our child's dreams. Let's head up to the mountain. Do 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 Bum ba dum bum Okay, doke. I probably should have brought some items with me now that I think about it in hindsight, but we can walk back. It's fine. It's fine. Ooh, hello, white, white weasel. I also gotta notice, um, there's no more, like, bamboo shoots that are growing here anymore. I wonder, I do wonder if it's my fault. For like cutting down all the trees that are on this mountain path, like maybe the trees are responsible for the bamboo shoots spawning. Which yeah, might be the case actually. <laughs> oh well, my other other option to get bamboo shoots, I think, is uh the flea market. You can still get them, but they won't be as good quality. It's kind of weird how that works. Like the trees don't grow back here. It's like everything's permanent. Still get branches here though. 
Do 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 do. All right, I I think the goddess is up here. Or do I, do I have to go up the rainbow? <laughs> okay, no, it's here. <laughs> I was like, please don't tell me I have to go up that rainbow. <laughs> ah, Gabriel. Hey, I haven't seen you guys in a while. Perfect timing. The Harvest Goddess has something to say. Please listen. Gabriel, another island needs your help. I fear it will go through the same turmoil that this island endured, unless something is done. But we can't leave this island. Huh. So are there like other islands with like trees and goddesses on them, are there? Are there? Please, they need someone like you to help them prosper once again. I mean, I'll go. What should I do? <laughs> I will go and help or I must go and help. Yes or yes, I will go and help. I don't know what to say. Hey. Artemis is the one who should help. She's just a child, Ben. Don't make me slap you. Artemis is the one who heard the Harvest Goddess calling, right? She did, but still. It's a sign. It's time for, for Artemis to start their journey. Just as you did, Gabriel, but I wasn't one years old. Please. I'm begging you. Let your child begin a new life? I can't decide now. I guess I guess you can come back later, but I mean, it, it's not your game's not gonna end at this this point. I don't think you still need to. I see you still need to create the journey, your exec. I guess, I guess it's time for her to go, man. Whole year, she's an she's an adult now. I'm begging you. Wait, I already said yes. It's okay, okay, Gabriel. I'm not asking you to decide now. When you think you're ready to let your kid begin life on their own, bring me the materials needed to make a journey wreck sack. I'll make one for your child so they can start their new life. When you want to know what materials you'll need, come see me anytime. All right, I'll, I'll see you right now. Just tell me, <laughs> tell me what you need. Oh, <laughs> wow. This would be horrible for our farmer. Like, he barely got his, like, family life. Like, his kid's barely grown up and we're already, like, tearing it apart. Feel free to ask about the required materials for their junior rucksack anytime. Thank you, Gabriel. Um, oh, you're here. What? You're actually interactable now. I can, I, I think I actually pretend. Befriend these guys, can I? No? Hmm. I love spring flowers. It doesn't look like they have friendship. <laughs> they did have, like, friendship. I get so sleepy when it's nice out. Yeah, they did have friendship in Animal Parade, but I think in here, it's just kind of a precursor. They're just, they just kind of exist. <laughs> You can't befriend him in this game. Alright, goddess, what do I need? Great, I see you're ready to make the rucksack. But you're still missing some materials. Which particular item would you like to ask about? Alright, we need shining wool yarn, shining flax yarn, black pearl, and rare metal. We did gather these things in anticipation for this. So, what about the shining wool yarn? Shining wool yarn is taken from sheep that are raised with lots of love. Shining flax yarn. Shining flax yarn is made from the highest quality flax seeds that are raised with love. Or just lots of fertilizer. Lots and lots of fertilizer. You don't need love. You need fertilizer and water. And maybe a lot of them to increase the probability. <laughs> That you'll get a shining one. How about the black pearl? Black pearls are very rare. 
But you can find them on the beach of Toucan Island. It took us a while to find a second one, but we managed to find one a while back. And rare metal, which we can gather on our own. We find from a rare mineral that can be found deep within the mines. Specifically, they seem... Rare ore seems to specifically be found in, like, the white crystals. That's where we found all of ours. Alright, that's the four items we need. Okay, I'll be right here waiting for you when you've got everything. Good luck. Alright, let's go home. Let's actually go to bed. Um, yeah, I'm still kind of gunning for other cutscenes as well. <laughs> Which I don't know if I'll be able to get them sooner or later. This, yeah, this this journey wreck exact thing is something that we, that we can control. But there's actually like two events. I'll just say like what they're about. It's pretty much like I think your kid getting sick, and then like you being the worrying doting parent, like going through that stage of their life when they get sick and then like it's actually not that serious and be like oh they just got a cold or something but yeah it's like kind of an rng an rng event you just have to wake up a random day and it happens <laughs> maybe it'll happen tomorrow <laughs> if everything will just happen all at once that would be great um ah, actually there's an event that i can do today As well. Sorry, I'm like kinda all over the place. <laughs> kinda airy fairy. Um, I can do this one on a weekday. So let's go to town hall. I am gonna need to wait a bit, so maybe I'll chat with some people. It's a very specific time frame that you have to go to. It's between 2 p.m. and 3 p.m. Uh, is there anyone I can talk to in here? Hi, y Yolanda. I haven't seen you in forever. Yolanda. Good morning. How are you? I'm just peachy. I haven't talked to you in forever, I guess. Do -do -do -do. Hey, Hamilton. I found out how to make the journey rucksack. Good afternoon to you. How are you doing? <laughs> Is everyone just like giving me like greeting dialogue just because I haven't talked to them for like a year? <laughs> I don't think affection goes down. Like, it doesn't look like anyone hates me. Hey, how you doing, Gil? Hi. Kids are fussy about food. It's a par it's a parent's fault. You have to feed them a variety of things. You have to just force them, force them to eat their vegetables. I mean, it's kind of hard. <laughs> There's a lot of kids that just will just say no, will clamp their mouth shut, and just won't eat stuff. It just tastes bad. All right, I think I can actually go in here. It's like just, it's like a few more, few more minutes. Let me talk to Gil. Is it true that your father sent you away at the age of one? <laughs> I feel like his, his journey was probably just him going to boarding school. <laughs> he just sent his kid to boarding school. <laughs> Children grow so fast. I saw your child was half as big the other day. <laughs> I mean, you're not wrong. <laughs> Hi. How are you? Alright, I hope this happens today. It's almost 2 p.m. The f Wait. Oh, okay. I was like, do all the posters have something to say? No, just just the one with Hamilton on it. Do 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 do. Alright, let's go upstairs. Um it's two. Does it not happen today? Is it cause I already saw another cutscene today? Do I have to walk in and out? Hmm. I should be able to do this. It just needs to be your tour later. Um, all the kids have to have two hearts. Including our child. And... 
has to be a weekday, it doesn't matter the weather, and you must have married one of the marriage candidates that don't have a rival. So you pretty much had to, you had to have gotten all the other all the other people married <laughs> so they can have their kids. But I guess it's not happening today. Oh well. It says like it happens Monday through Friday. I, I hope it's not random. <laughs> or else I'm gonna have to go every day until it happens. That's a long time to wait. Do do. All right. Well, let's go to sleep. Sleep another day. Now this is like this is long. <laughs> We're already at a half an hour, and we haven't even done any time skipping. This is gonna be a long last episode. It looks like. Do. Well, if anything, we could probably sleep for a season. <laughs> Alright. Uh, let's gather what we need for the journey rack sack, because we'll probably go there tomorrow to get it, but we won't give it to our child until we're ready to, like, end the game. So, it says, shiny flax. Um, where's my shiny wool? Did I put it in another one? I think I put it in another, another box. I did. I put it in here. Shiny wool. Um, where's my rare metal? I swear I got rare metal. Okay, there's a black pearl. Black pearl, done. Rare metal, did I put it in here with the other metals? There it is. Okay, I got all this stuff. Let's go to bed. Good night. No money made. Bum bum ba -dum bum Let's go. Let's -a go. Darling, eat your lunch and work hard today. I received a de decent lunch box. Good morning. Keep an eye on Artemis is so hard. I'm exhausted. Alright, nothing new today with you. Good morning. Huh? Don't 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 be confused. Here, have some tea. Wake up. Wake up with some caffeine. That's it. Alright. Alright, I'll go get the rucksack today. And then maybe I'll sleep for another day? Maybe like... Maybe if like no other cutscenes happen that day, I could try to... I could try to get the cutscene with all the kids. So maybe I'll do it on Thursday. Do 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 So at this point there's gonna be a lot of clipping happening. <laughs> Gotta walk all the way back. Do 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 bum 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 Let's go <laughs> I was like, I just got reminded of the, the magic circle. I do kind of wonder, it's probably faster to actually go to Maple Lake. The Maple Lake District and then just take the rainbow over here. There it is, not fall. Cause that would... Man, this is... Let's walk carefully. So we don't waste all our time. Alright, goddess, I got you all these strange items so you can weave me a bag. Do, 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 do. Wow, you collected all the materials for the rucksack. Thank you for all your hard work. You've done a- you, you've done great, Gabrielle. Yes, I did a, I did a good. All the materials are set now. Let's make that rucksack. Uh, is this gonna be like some sort of ritual or? Oh God, okay. <laughs> you guys are just all dancing, all happily. 
Um, what are you doing? Ta-da! It's done, okay. <laughs> it's finished. You just- you just prayed a bag into existence. Once you give your child this, it'll set them on the path to adulthood. Uh, that's kind of sweet to think about that art. Like, not like in this game, but in the future, your kid will be a child. I <laughs> your kid will be an adult. <laughs> I mean, all kids will eventually become adults, but still. Make sure you're absolutely positive you're ready to give it to them, Gabriel. Think hard about. Oh God, this is edge. Think hard about when. Give it. <laughs> Don't cry, Edge. I'm done with you. All right then, Gabriel. It's all in your hands now. Literally, it's in our hands. It's our choice. Great. Whether or not we want to end the game. So we got the journey rucksack. So yeah, it's gonna be in our inventory. Do not give it unless you're ready. <laughs> Unless you're ready to end this game. Um, just in case, you should probably, like, save your progress over, like, a separate save file. Because it will... It will take over that file that you're playing on currently. So yeah, in case you want to go back to this dude. So, if you could probably guess it, this is... This, is, this will start New Game Plus, which is the same as the base game. But, you get some additions. You get all the money from your previous file, so all our riches. So if you want, you, you could probably liquidize all your items. So you can actually kind of carry it over in like money form. Um, plus 10,000 gold. They give you a little extra in case you didn't actually have that much money. Um, all your item lists. So like all the crops you've grown, like animal products you've gotten, all the books you've gotten, all the recipes, all the things are, are pretty much unlocked and viewable on your bookshelf. Those are those are available on your bookshelf, so it's kinda like an indicator of of completionists completionism. If you like unlocked all the recipes. Um, all your tools begin at level 3. I think you still have to upgrade them to, like, different metal qualities. But you'll you'll be able to charge them up to level 3, at the very least. Um, all makers will be available in the barn and coop once the barn and coop have been built. So we'll have our yarn maker, we'll have our mayo maker, our cheese maker, our butter maker. But you won't be able to access them until you actually build your barn and coop. So none of the buildings carry over. Which kind of sucks, but... You kind of work around that. By, uh, just having lots of money to be able to buy the buildings right away. And then... What's unique to the New Game Plus save file is that you'll actually get letters from no Mom and Dad. I'm not sure what the letters say. Probably, like, generic stuff. Like, how you doing? But, yeah. It's like... Is like theoretically the character that you're playing would be your kid, and then yeah, you get letters from like theoretically this dude and Luna, which is kind of weird to think about because you're gonna be on an island that's gonna have all the same characters, so you could potentially marry your own mother. <laughs> kind of creepy to think about. Um, oh right, I did say I was gonna go to sleep. Oh well, I could just double check again and then I'll come back here on Thursday if it doesn't activate today. And it's Wednesday, it's it's almost two. I spent a lot of time just like wandering about, so I did kill some time without me having to think about it. Two, two, two. Let's go upstairs. No, not today. Not today, Satan. <laughs> Come on. Alright, baby. Maybe I'll. Alright. I'll try again tomorrow. And then we go to bed. There's gonna be some. 
some skipping ahead it seems like happening. Yeah, I'll go to bed. I don't know if I'll check every day. Maybe I'll check tomorrow. And then maybe I'll check again in like a month. There's not really a time limit to get these cutscenes. Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. Let's go to sleep and see if something happens. Okay, no one's home. Let's go to sleep. Good night. Badum, zero gold. All right, anything happening today? I got, I got lunch box. All right, nothing happening today. So, here I'll just give you here, here's some tea. Just try to get my kid to ten hearts. I have a feeling, I have a feeling she's gonna get to ten hearts really quickly, and I could probably, probably stop giving her things fairly soon. I mean, what was that? Seven hearts? Is that seven hearts right now? All right. So I guess I'll BRB. I'll see if I can get the the cutscene at the town hall today. And if not, I'm just gonna I'm just gonna keep sleeping <laughs> until something happens. All right. BRB. Let's go. Oh, here we go. All right. It's up for like. What, two weeks? I'm not sure what day it is anymore. <laughs> uh, it's an emergency, darling. Artemis has a fever. Oh, okay, I'll go get the doctor. I like how she still sleeps in the baby bed. <laughs> we didn't get her a, a, like a child bed. I guess the crib is big enough. Seems it's just a case of the flu. Don't worry too much. The flu is not the worst things. I mean, it is pretty bad for like the young and the elderly. It could kill them. But like, if you're if you're an adult, then usually you're strong enough to fight it off. Or if or if you're immune compromised, then that's also a dangerous thing. Just make sure your child gets plenty of fluids and rest. And don't worry, it's just the flu. Your child will be fine again in no time. Just the flu. <laughs> I mean, we have vaccines for that. I mean, like, we're trying to avoid the flu as much as possible. I should get going now. Please take care. Thank you very much. And I think this takes up the whole day, actually. I was so worried. I feel a bit foolish. We still have a lot to learn. Just, I like he overreacted. We spent the entire day taking care of Artemis and no chores are done. Which doesn't matter because I don't have any chores. <laughs> the day's over. <laughs> Ta-da. Alright, I'm glad I got that, that cutscene sooner rather than later. Let's go. Um, yeah, I'm still trying to get that cutscene in the town hall. <laughs> And the only only thing I could think about is like befriending Gil. Because I try to look up other cutscenes of like the same people like people doing the same thing. And everyone is married to Gil, so of course he'd be at ten hearts, so maybe he has like a special heart requirement. I don't know. I haven't I haven't what, what two right now. Doesn't seem to be doing any good. Um I'll try to activate it today on a Monday. Let's see, have some tea. More tea, please. Probably should have talked to you first. Sometimes people call me mouthy, but I'm just telling I'm just telling it how I see it. <laughs> oh, you giving them giving them flack, are you? 
How you doing, Luna? After that sickness scare. Okay, just normal dialogue, it seems, after the sickness scene. Alright, so that is... That was a sickness part one event. There is a part two to this. That also just kind of happens whenever. <laughs> so it'll be another... Another time skip where I just sleep ahead. How many hearts do I have with Artemis, by the way? Oh, she's at... Okay, she's at nine hearts. She's almost, she's almost maxed out, so I could probably stop giving her tea soon. Um, I'm gonna keep trying to get that event at the town hall, and of course I'm gonna keep sleeping to get sickness part two. And yeah, I'll, I'll BRB. Let's go! Oh, okay. <laughs> well, I got this event first before the one at the town hall. All right, she's sick again. It's summer. How she? How she get? How she get a cold in the summer? <laughs> it's an emergency, darling. Artemis has a fever. Okay, go back and get Irene. <laughs> we were doing a horrible job taking care of this kid. Hmm. It seems that your child just has a case of the common cold. Alright, that's that's even less alarming than the flu. A, a cold? Is that so? Just make sure your child gets plenty of rest and stays warm. I mean, it is summer. And don't worry. It's perfectly normal for a child to get a cold. Okay, we're not horrible parents, I guess. I should get going now. Please take care. Thank you very much. He spent the entire day taking care of Artemis. <laughs> yeah, and yeah, that just takes up the whole day. And I think that's the last time your child gets sick, so Let's go. I don't think this event reoccurs, I don't believe. Alright, Artemis, you doing okay? Fine after a day? I don't really want to get married. Maybe I will when I'm older. I mean, you're too young to think about that. Girl. <laughs> Girl. Ugh. Alright, there's still one more event. I gotta... I try to... I gotta try to activate with my kid. But, like, it won't activate. So, I, I don't know if I should keep trying or just end it. I'll keep trying. But... If I can't, maybe I'll make a bonus video. <laughs> With that, no commentary, just just pure cutscene. I mean, it wouldn't be bad cuz I think the one that's up on YouTube is kind of like old quality, so it w might be nice to have a higher quality one up with like a different kid as well. So yeah, I'll I'll BRB. I'll give it a few more attempts. And, yeah, if not, then I'll probably just- I'll just end it. <laughs> I'll send my kid away on a journey. Okay, let's try this again. <laughs> okay. Alright, it happened. This seems very random. I- This- <laughs> Aw, look at them. They're so cute. All together, congregating. All right, would someone like to read this next passage? Oh, they're all so excited. Oh no, Artemis, are you nervous? Artemis, why don't you read it? It was a beautiful spring day. The flowers were blooming, the sky was blue, and the sun was smiling bright. Just. <laughs> He's <laughs> mad. You mean shining. Uh, I mean the sun can be smiling. It could be that sun baby from Teletubbies. I don't know. Oops. Yeah, I mean shining, not smiling. Oops. Yeah, you did it. That's really cute. Oh. <laughs> and that's it. <laughs> that's really 
all I was like agonizing going for. So yeah, I'm guessing it's just random actually. Um, there's some people that said you needed to be in your five, some people said you need friendship with your kids, some people say that I didn't get any friendship with any of the kids. And I only had two hearts with Gil, I don't know if he needed two hearts. But like everyone else who seemed to have gotten it was like actually married to Gil, so Gil already had ten hearts. So, I don't know, I'm just gonna chalk it up to RNG. That was a cute cutscene, very short. <laughs> just shows all the kids going to school. And yeah, once again, you can't, you can't get that cutscene. Unless you have all the rival children unlocked, which is kind of unfortunate. Cause, yeah, that means if you marry... If you marry like any of the bachelor or the bachelorettes that had a rival, um, you wouldn't be able to get that scene. But you're not missing much, I guess. <laughs> it's a pretty short cutscene. All right, I think I'm about ready to end it. <laughs> so, where's my child? Um, maybe I'll maybe I should save. Maybe I'll start a new day so I don't have to track down my child as well. Do 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 do. All right, I was able to get all the cutscenes within like in like a month, so that's good. I was worried I was gonna have to like sleep for a year <laughs> to get them all. Okay, doke. Let's go to bed so my child can come back home. Ding, today's earning zero. Let's go. Right, let's see how the final the final cutscene goes. I haven't seen it. I don't know what's gonna happen. Uh, before you do that, make sure you save. Um, preferably on a separate save file if you do want to go back to your old file, because yeah, this will this will take over your current save file. So let's save over here. Don't need this anymore. And uh, okay, let's give our kid the journey rucksack. Wait, Papa, is this by any chance? It is. Time for you to get out of the house. The <laughs> Luna's <laughs> Luna's pissed. I can't agree. It's too soon. I mean, you're not wrong, but still. She's leaving. <laughs> what? Mama is so hard headed. <laughs> oh, you're gonna have to. But. <laughs> hmm. Alright, we're gonna have to convince Mama somehow to let. to let Artemis go. It doesn't look like anything's happening today, so I probably have to go to sleep. You may be able to beat me in a race now, but I've been in a couple years, I'll be able to beat you easily. Yeah, you just gotta get your legs longer. Alright, let's go to bed. Good night. Aww. Let's go to sleep. Let's go. Let's go. Alright, received my lunchbox, and our child has off the map, it seems like. Oh no, where, where's Artemis? Why is she no longer in existence? You're not- you're not worried? You're not worried that our child- <laughs> My tracker is, is- is foolproof, you know. I know where everyone is at all times. Where is she? Alright, well we have to go to bed again, I think. <clears throat> let's not look for our child, let's just sleep. Sleep is a solution to all our problems. <laughs> I'm just fast asleep. Darling! She hasn't come home yet. What am I gonna do? Huh? What? Where'd she go? Oh no. Oh no, this music is awful. I've never heard this before. This is depressing. I bet this music probably plays when an animal dies, though. It does sound like animal death music. 
It's because I opposed the decision? Is that why Artemis got upset? Artemis is still a child! It's alright, Luna. It's my fault. You know what I mean. Artemis is just being reckless just to make us worry. We must punish our child when they come back. Well, okay. <laughs> Luna, you scare me. Papa, Mama! Where were you? Oh. Oh no, are you okay? I went to find a gift for Mama to remember me by. Oh. I mean, you're not gonna die. <laughs> I mean, can't you like come back and visit? Mama would cry if she were lonely. Here, keep this with you to remind me. And the cars are racing outside. Here, keep this with you to remind you of me always. What'd you give her? Aw, wow, rare ore. Here, here's a rock! Remember me! Artemis, I'm sorry. I... I thought you were just being selfish. But now, I know you cared all along. Thank you. I'll take care of it always. Darling, it's it's time to give Artemis the rucksack. Do you want to give your child the rucksack? <laughs> the last chance, guys. Alright, we're gonna give it. A new story will start with your child. Your game will be taken over. <laughs> Do you want to give your child the rucksack? Yes. I already split my file. It's fine. Yay! Great! Now they have their own rucksack. Oh, the goddess. What? What is this? Oh, okay. Gabriel, to start Artemis on their journey? Oh. What? With the power of the harvest sprites. What realm are you, are you in? <laughs> Strange dark realm. And with your own power. Am I a magician? Your child's future will be full of happiness and tranquility. Hey, what's happening? Oh, okay, we're sending her on a boat. Alright, you, you might you might hit some storms and you might pass out, alright? Just be careful. Aw, oh, Chloe, you're sad. Are you friends? Are you friends with my daughter? Artemis. Hey, I came to see you off. You're Gabriel's kid, so I'm sure it'll be fine. I wish all the other rival kids would come and like say goodbye. Like, wouldn't they be like friends? I guess they potentially wouldn't exist though, so I guess they didn't put them in the cutscene. All these people exist at, like, the beginning of the game. <laughs> the Barbara. Artemis! Stay well. Take care of yourself, okay? <laughs> Artemis! Chloe. Oh. You're really leaving? I'm gonna miss you. I promise I'll come visit you. Don't forget about me. <laughs> Where's Chloe's, like, journey rucksack? She's older than my kid. No. Oh. I guess my child is the chosen one. Chosen by the goddess. Last call for all passengers. The ship is about to set sail. Uh, 
take care. Stay well. I'll be sure to write you. Aww, this is sad. <laughs> Papa, Mama, I... I have something I've always wanted to tell you, but I... I couldn't. I love you, Papa and Mama, so very much. Please take care. Aww. Wait, is this a new game? This is like, this is the intro of like a new game. Oh. Okay, we get more credits. <laughs> Second credits. Alright, I guess that's... That's like... That's the end. I, I guess I'll check out my save file though after this. Um, well, yeah, that was, that was our new tree tranquility. We get to send off our child. Our child on her own quest. So, yeah, I, I do want to check to see if the New Game Plus file is going to be a boy character or if it'll be a girl character based off my my child's gender. Um, I couldn't really find any answers to that. I know in Animal Parade and New Game Plus you're able to choose if you wanted to play as a boy or a girl again, so I'm just gonna double check here. Oh, that would actually be nice if I could play as a girl. <laughs> like, maybe. Maybe in the future I could play, like, as a girl and, like, we could marry a bachelor, but I don't know, we'll probably experience all the bachelor, the bachelor stuff in Animal Parade. Oh, yeah. It is kind of nice. That our kid, we get to do stuff with our kid. Unfortunately, um, your next, your next character is gonna look like the default protagonist. You don't actually get to play as your kid. There's no like unique model in New Game Plus. A lot of people, a lot of people are disappointed that you couldn't play as your actual child. So you just have to kind of leave it up to imagination. I mean, she has brown hair, so. I guess she could grow up to look like the protagonist. <laughs> Do -do -do. All right. Uh, what else? Oh, yeah. Um, we will not be playing Animal Prey for a while, probably. Um. Well, we'll take like a little break. I do want to play another LP. That has a bit more action to it. Just to kind of change up things. I don't want things to get too tedious. <laughs> we are doing a dating sim, like kind of on the side. <laughs> As like a side project. <laughs> so, I don't know. I kind of, it's kind of similar to Harvest Moon. I play Harvest Moon a lot like a dating sim because I like, I try to woo all, all the boys or woo all the girls. Oh yeah, next LP will be a bit more action-y. And then after that we'll we'll probably play Animal Parade. And that that's gonna be a really long LP. We're we're it's almost gonna seem like a slog probably. We'll try to take our time and we'll take like probably breaks in between it and play other games while we're playing Animal Parade so stuff doesn't get too stale. Is it literally literally gonna show me a picture of every harvest sprite? There's Alan. There's... Okay, this is the end. Cause I got no more credits to show me. And... Is this the loading screen? This looks like... This looks like the boot up screen is black. Alright, reading file. Alright, um... Yeah, let's... we could actually save it over here. Eh, let's save it over here. It's not... it's not so long to go through a month of game. Yeah, let's go save it over file 2. 
Oh, so it is a girl. All right. <laughs> that's that's good to know. We have all our money. All our progress is gone. So, okay, that that is some good information to know. The gender of your child will determine um yeah, what protagonist you play as in your new game plus. You can't you can't switch it like you could in Animal Parade. All right. All right, we saved. I think that's it. I think... I think that's it. I... I will save that New Game Plus file for whenever. <clears throat> I did already say, like, what, what you get in a New Game Plus. Um, the story's all gone. You don't have any... None of the people are unlocked, of course. You don't have any affection with anyone. Um, but yeah, you do get to keep all your money. Get to keep your recipe and other records like that. Your tools start at level 3, but you still have to upgrade upgrade your tools either at the tool, at the, at the blacksmith, or at the general store. Um, you get your makers, but you still have to build all the buildings again. And what's unique is that you also get letters from your mom and dad occasionally. Just kind of checking in how you doing. But yeah, otherwise gameplay is exactly the same as a new game. Right, is it, is, it's making me watch the cutscene. <laughs> the starting cutscene again. No. No. Alright. Anywho. I hope you guys had a relaxing time, and I'll see you in the next LP! Oh, bye-bye!